Ever. We're already Just starting happened. off with tears. Good thing. Hey everyone! It is that time to check out the first two episodes of The Summer I Turned Pretty Season 2. If you haven't checked out my Season 1 reaction or my reaction to Season 2's trailer, make sure you do so because there were a lot of stuff going on in those reactions. A lot of facial expressions, a lot of comments, and a lot going on. And um, I'm ready. I don't know if I really am ready, but I'm ready. I have tissues this time actual tissues because I was not prepared for the season one finale. Again, if you haven't checked that out, go do so. There were a lot of tears. And um, yeah, I'm just ready. Let's go. Let's do this thing. And make sure you check out my Patreon for more. All right. Episode one called Love Lost. Oh boy. I know I'm setting up myself for failure, but let's see. Conrad. Is this a dream? Oh, there's the necklace. Yeah, these guys are into each other. You two are perfect together. Oh, this is a dream. I mean, it was always supposed to be them, right? Yup, she was dreaming. Conrad and I weren't together, and Susanna was dead. Nothing would ever be the same again. Hey, you, oh. you, you dropped this. Reading The Hunger Games in, in... I never read The Hunger Games or watched The Hunger Games. I think I may have seen parts of the first one, but only because I was on a bus trip. Escaping to your dreams is easier than living with your memories. Though Susanna died. Really, that's the hard part. Though the trial didn't work. <laughs> this doesn't feel real. So Jeremiah didn't, you know? Yeah, I mean, they're so cute. Though they're both going to shut down when Susanna dies. Uh there's something that I need to tell you. I hooked up with your brother. Okay, what is it? A few days ago, Jeremiah told me she was for me. No. Uh -oh. oh. Oh boy. Wow, okay. Like, he didn't know that? Like, he couldn't tell? What did you say? I kissed him a few times. Oh boy. You know, but there were moments this summer where I thought maybe there could be something with you and me, and then, you know, you shut down and, and get no, really cold. And I get I'm it. I get I'm sorry. It. I'm sorry. It's not my fault. Too. I mean, yeah, because, like, she put all her feelings in the wrong brother. I'm sorry. It is the wrong brother. I'm sorry. I'm Team Conrad. Being with you is all I've ever wanted. Okay, it's great. Be with me, then. Everyone in our house knows that I've had a crush on you ever since, like... Wait, 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 wait. You have a crush on me? <gasps> no. Yeah. That's so cute. How can people not love this? Like, I'll talk to him. He might not even be that upset, you know? Oh, come yeah, on. Never... I mean, he's been secretly after Belly forever. Uh, I'll talk to him first. I owe him that. Okay. She does owe him that. But of course, Jeremiah's not going to take it. Uh-oh. Yeah, memories. She's still alive. Walk on the beach? Mm-hmm. I mean, she was always a fan of them. I knew it. Yes, Susanna was always a fan of the two of them. Now she's gotta go talk to Jeremiah. Did she right. talk to Jeremiah? Or did he find out um, some other way? Oh, uh, Summer. Not the same. <laughs> hey, Bells. What's with Taylor's hair? Wow. Different. New. No. Oh, he's going to Princeton. Cool. Wait, so are you coming to the party? I don't know. This has such a different feeling than the first season. But I get it because it has to be. Yeah, she's not I okay. Was your endotur but your grades have been dipping all year. You even got your volleyball captaincy revoked. Wow. She's, she's had, had a rough have year. You, um, have you heard about Finch? Oh, boy. Yeah, I know someone who's going there in the fall. Family friend. Great. Well, maybe you can visit them and grab a tour. No. That's awkward. Come in. Good morning, Bells. Hey. Come here. No, oh, boy. Doing research on, on the trial my mom agreed to. And Bell, yeah, I'm, I'm feeling really hopeful. Don't be hopeful, man. That's just spit it out, Belly. Last night, I really couldn't sleep all night, so I went, went to the to beach, and there was Conrad. I know this is not something you just spit out, but... Conrad was there, and we just started talking, and one thing led to another, and, and, um, and we, we kissed. And here comes the messy part. You kissed my brother. Cher, I didn't want to hurt you. You're, you're one of my best friends. No, no, you don't, you don't get to call me that. Oh boy, she definitely made a mess out of things, but I mean Jeremiah always knew that Belly had a thing for his brother. Didn't he use himself as her distraction to keep her away from Conrad so that he can have her? I'm just saying. Oh, is that for me? 
Wait, a laptop? Who sent this? What? Cleveland. Oh my god. It's from Susanna. Oh. She must have planned it before. Classic Beck. I wish she could have been here. I thought it was gonna be Cleveland for some reason. Yeah, Conrad and Jeremiah too. They were busy. Yeah, sure. Oh. So he lost his two best friends he because of his awful. sister. He was so angry at us. Not at us. At you. It's gonna be okay, brother. I promise. Are you guys gonna fight again? Maybe we should hit pause. You just started! Important thing right now is that you and Jeremiah are there for each other. I mean, I do this like that she's Susanna. taking herself out of the equation for Susanna. Being together would make that impossible. Ellie, come on. I can't do that to him. But what about Conrad? I hate that. Yeah, me too. She finally got the person she's wanted forever. And then um, this just had to happen. I mean, I get where Jeremiah is coming from. I know he liked Belly, but like he knew that Conrad was always going to be the one. He couldn't just change that overnight, like, you know? It's kind of like Brooke, Peyton, and Lucas. I'm sorry, but Brooke knew that Lucas always had feelings for Peyton. So is Cleveland thrown around? I would think he'd be there if he was. Why? I don't know. Sometimes a girl dumps you after an awesome summer and sucks and... I guess Shayla broke up with him. Belly. I like that we're getting memories. Hey, I never seen me. Ugh, your mom assigned me this room to clean. It's the easiest since I don't think she sat foot in here once to do any writing this summer. <laughs> no, she was in there once at the very beginning of the summer. I just feel like I'm losing everyone. You're not. It just takes time. Oh, God, I'm already feeling tears. You'll find your way back to each other. And this place is always here for you. Oh crap. No, it's not. You made every summer here so magical, Susanna. I mean, what happens, Ellie? You love this place the same way I do. Oh jeez. If anyone can keep the magic going here, it's you. And that's the whole point of this season. Oh my god. Promise me you'll never leave. Oh jeez. She can't promise you that. Because every We're already starting happened. off with tears. Good thing. Make what you want happen because tomorrow isn't promised. So you better make fucking sure that you are living today. I mean, that was a very impactful uh, speech, but I can see the anger in him because he pretty much lost his two best friends. And he saw that coming. He said, you're going to make a mess out of it or so whatever. Extra. It's a great speech. Susanna would have loved it. You know, I'm glad you guys are coming to the party tonight. Wow, I can't believe what I'm hearing. You really want me and Taylor at your party? Wow, I've never said one. But he's just happy? I just think it's better than moping around at home. Yeah. Hey, like, you should drive. Yeah. I gotta read all the love in my DMs for my speech anyway, so... I come on. <laughs> they, like, so grew up. But now I get the ages. Yeah, now he's, he's like, 17, 18. Uh, Belly's, like, 17. Because yeah, she's gonna I'm be a senior. <laughs> I gotta forward this to Con and Jeremiah. Uh... And um, Jeremiah is Belly's age, yeah. and Conrad is Stevens' age. You are the best. You're gonna have the time of your life at Princeton, right, Laura? Yeah, I love college. That's where I met Susanna. Oh. So, how are things going with your book? Uh, my publisher is hounding me to do this meet and greet event with booksellers. I said no. Why not? Okay. Susanna would want you to. Not necessary. I mean, meet and greets do help. I did my first author's <laughs> event this uh, year. Sold a couple books. So you're not trying to promote your book? I'm not going to have schmoozy conversations about Susanna just to get prime placement in bookstores. Well, you did write a whole book. Oh. You know, it's really cathartic. But the whole not going to therapy thing is working out for you. You have to go to therapy, especially if you lose someone as close as Susanna as you Susanna did. To you have to. She was always my biggest cheerleader. Guess now I have to be my own. I'll wear the skirt, but I draw the line at pom pom. See, it's nice that, like, <laughs> even though they divorced and they're not together anymore, that, like, they could joke around with each other. Ah, Belly's bedroom, where we first met her in season one. I don't know if I like Taylor's hair. Oh, the call came the second week of September, three weeks since the last time I'd seen him. Yeah, is it okay that I'm calling? I shouldn't have called. This was not hard. No, 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 no. It's okay. Um, I like that we're getting, like, flashbacks. I mean, obviously we have to. We need to know how everything, like, unraveled and, and then see how they bring it all back together. Uh, so how's, how's college like? 
Oh, so no, he's a year older than Steven. And then I guess Jeremiah is Steven's age. So Belly's the youngest of all four. Sorry about that. Okay, um, what were you saying about triangles again? Oh, he's helping her with her homework. But eventually, you're gonna have to let him go. Like, how do you let people go when you've known them your whole lives? Yeah, your relationship changed, but like, how do you just let them go? Going to a grad party? Have fun. And don't drink and drive. Oh, don't worry. I promised Stephen I'd be the sober driver. Oh, and I ordered you a pizza, okay? So please eat it. Bye. Oh, they trying to take care of their mom. So where's Cleveland? Cleveland in this at all? Help her snap out of it? I mean, I get it. You lost your best friend. I can't even imagine that. Like, at all. Oh, my God. Hi. Oh, okay. Oh, my God. Yeah, I don't like him at all. No. No, Taylor. No. Steven is jealous. I can see that. No. So they're still talking. Did you know my dad cheated? The first time my mom was with his secretary. Always the secretary. I found out about it last spring. Like, like the same day I found out about my mom's I knew it! I knew he knew that too! No wonder he was a mess in the first season. Finding out your dad cheated and finding out that your mom has cancer the same day? Oh man, that's got to look. It sucks that you had to carry that secret for so long. Yeah, it's just exhausting. Yeah, like, come on. Um, off-season workouts suck, but uh, there's a rumor that college scout from Finch is coming to watch our club team play this weekend. What? That's crazy. I'll definitely let you go. I didn't know that. So Conrad is at Finch, so I'm like very, I'm confused. So was she talking about Conrad being at Finch? Or talking about Jeremiah going to Finch? Cause she said she has a friend going to Finch in the fall. Or she meant this past fall, whatever. I took French in high school, but I didn't really retain much of it. He's another one that has like a mix of Jeremiah and um, Conrad. She has a type. She does. This is like the only song I like of ever. I mean, like, look at you and Milo. You guys just make sense. No, they don't. No, they're not. Steven still has a thing for Taylor. Why do I feel like Milo's gonna end up like being a cheater or something? That usually happens. It happened to step up. Why is there a lot of cover songs he's singing? Oh no. Uh, Billy, I'm sorry. No, yeah, no, I, I'm good. I'm You're my sober driver, Billy Bells. Don't let me down. Steven. Wow. He tried too much. Who, Steven? Did he, like, get yeah. drunk? Like, nothing about my... I love these, like, like, conversations. But, like, Jeremiah find out that they're still talking? Because she's not <laughs> calling Jeremiah. Send any of this to anyone before? Me That's why they're meant to be together. Um, how's... How's Jer? Is he, is he doing okay? Yeah, no, I mean, he's probably just busy with senior year stuff. Okay, so there's... No, no, yeah, oh, no, 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 no. So Steven and Jeremiah are the same age. Conrad is older. And then Belly's the youngest of all four. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. 263 days out of the year. And then it disappears from the sky for 15 days before returning as a morning star for another 263 days. Wow. Really bright next to the moon. That must be uh, the star that I see next to the moon the last few nights. Hmm, interesting. Perfect timing for this little astronomy lesson. I took astronomy in college. I think I spoke about this. I couldn't be with someone who didn't make me feel electric either. No. They're still cute together. Is that seat taken? Uh, no, no. Uh, yeah. 
I wonder if Venus is a morning star or an evening star tonight. I think Venus is a planet. No, actually, uh, ancient astronomers, um, you know what? Never mind. Okay. It's dumb. <laughs> Not dumb. I, uh, used to spend every summer at this beach in Massachusetts. Yep. Are you going this summer? Nope. Uh, nope. No, I'm not. Or the the first summer without cousins. All my folks are going to be out of town. And think about having a few people over. You and your friends should totally come. No. You tried this with Cameron. Uh, Belly, no, I was just... Oh my god! No, I was yeah, just... No. You had something in your... I have something. Yeah. You know why? Because I just... It's crap. I just got kicked in the head. That's right. But no, no, no. I'm totally fine. I'm just... Oh my god. Um, yeah, friends. that was I totally know. awkward, man. <laughs> totally awkward. <laughs> Great, then can you just call an Uber or something? Why, why are you being such a buzzkill oh right now? Oh, Kinda, yeah. uh, here we go with the fight. Which it clearly seems like you did. Susanna just died, so I'm a little bit sad. But please, don't let that stop you from having the time of your life. Yep, here we go. Too. Okay, you, you don't think I'm sad about that? Oh, you well, sure don't act like it. Pain away? My apologies. No, you should apologize. You had Jeremiah, and it just wasn't enough. You had to have Conrad, too. But she wanted so. Conrad <laughs> more. Are you kidding? No. Oh, boy. I was in love, Stephen. Like, out of my mind in love. What was I supposed to do? Belly. Belly. Like, how do you not see that? Were you, like, the only other person that see, didn't yeah. realize He's that Belly, um, more than like with Conrad? Right now, but I promise you. No, 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 no. can't promise anything. Because Susanna <laughs> promised that she'd be around. I just have to deal with it alone. No, you don't. I mean, it's your boyfriend's debut. And but best friends, man. Best. best friends before anything. Like, Brooke always said hoes before bros. Not like that, like, really worked out with them, but clothes over bros, dude. I mean, I don't understand why, like, Jeremiah and Conrad should still, like, talk to Steven. Because Steven didn't have anything to do with it. Oh, boy, driver's license. The song that changed Olivia Rodrigo's life. But this is like the perfect song for this moment, though. Yep, perfect song. Perfect song for Belly. Oh, Belly. You should not be driving like this. Pull over. So what happened at the funeral? Are we gonna get that? We have to, right? Hey, almost how we Oh, you showed up. Uh, what? What are you doing here? I wanted to see you. Yeah, but I thought. Right, no, I know, I know you were worried about Jared, but look, I had a chance to talk to him, and uh, he's doing really good, actually. He's uh, going on dates, you know. That's great. So. Uh, he's so over you. Yeah, I think he is. Is he though? Is he really? Well, yeah, I don't think I could ever get over you. I gotta say, standing in front of you right now, it's torture, not being able to kiss you. No, I mean, come on, they're so cute. But is Jeremiah really over? Or is he just saying that? Like, what's gonna happen at the funeral? I need to know what happened at the funeral. Where's your brother? Talk, sit down. Uh-oh, did you find out about the school stuff? Probably. The guidance counselor emailed me. I didn't know you lost your volleyball captaincy or that your grades were so bad. This whole year has been hard for me too. Life keeps going. Can't just give up. Oh, what about her? You won't even promote your book because you refuse to talk about Susanna. You can't just suddenly be concerned about volleyball when you haven't gone to a single one of my games this year. I waited all year for you to step up and be a parent. You gave up way before I did. Oh, jeez. I mean, that's... Oh, wow. I mean, I get it. I get it from her point of view. I get it from Belly's point of view. I... Wow. Who yells at their own sister in front of everyone for being sad? Yeah, exactly. Are you supposed to like come together and grieve? Yeah, you are supposed to come I together. I actually have a record label interested in signing me. What? Cancel Culture Records. Not a real record company? They, they only have one post. <laughs> yeah, this was so punk about it. Nope, not real. Taylor, come on. You can do so much better than him. Is she gonna pick up the phone? Is she gonna change her mind? Oh, she's gonna read what Susanna wrote. I wish I could be there to watch you shine. Yeah. But you have an extraordinary mom who will be with you every step of the way. Remember, the world is not only happening to you, but you are happening to the world. He got the quote from... And don't forget to enjoy the ride. Oh, he, he added that part to his speech. 
Ah, oh, jeez. I'm glad I got tissues, because this is too much already. She's gonna call her publicist and say that she wants to do it? Hey, I know it's late, but about the bookseller event, I changed my mind. I'll do it. Yes! Do it! Do it! Do it! Do it! Do it! I knew I'd lose Susanna eventually. I just didn't know I'd end up losing all of them. In my memory, the three of them will always be entwined, forever linked. There can't be one without the others. No. That's no. hard. They're all gone. The soundtrack for this show is really good. Kind of reminds me of Wonder Hill. The music was so big and important in Wonder Hill. Calling Jeremiah, because I saw the commercial. Hi. Hi, Jeremiah, I'm so glad. Uh, are you with Conrad? Uh, no, why would I be with Conrad? I, I don't know, I just thought maybe you guys would. Um... He's gone. I saw that part in the trailer. Conrad's gone. Since when? I'll never get Susanna back, but I can't let Jeremiah and Conrad go too. Okay, but I'm coming with you. Ooh. No, really, the music in this show is very good. It's like a mix of like all different styles of music, which is kind of cool. And I don't know about Milo and his covers of the two songs he did. They weren't that mm, great, but um, well, <laughs> well, whatever. Um, wow. So much happened in this first episode. But I feel like we got majority of the trailer in this episode. I mean, not the scenes with Conrad or Jeremiah, obviously. That comes later when they're all together back at the beach house, I guess. But, wow. I already have used the tissue. And it's only the first episode of the season. I knew Susanna was gonna die. But there was also a part of me that hoped the trial would have worked. But uh, I should have also known that that doesn't happen in shows like this. Um, yeah, I I don't know. It's a lot. It's definitely a lot. So I think I'm just going to go right into the next one because now we're just getting started back up with the love triangle. But I really want to know what happened at the funeral. Probably they found out that Conrad and Belly were together again. And Jeremiah is actually not over Belly. Um, I don't know. Obviously something happened at the funeral. Time to check out episode two. Title is called Love Scene. Okay. She's gonna sneak out, like, and not have anybody know? I mean, she's not gonna let her mom know? Did she write a letter? Oh, this is a flashback. I'm like, it's Christmas. But she's still sneaking out. What, to be with Conrad? So they were sneaking around. So do they find out at the um, funeral? Hey, listen, this is kind of a long shot, but have you talked to him lately? So Conrad, like, dumped everybody? No. I mean, I like that Jeremiah is worried about his brother. He's being, like, the big brother in this scenario. The Summer Without You? Is that what that title is? never sleep in when I drink. What was that? Nothing. Well, I mean, not that I ever really drink. Come on. You knew what they did over the summer. It was Taylor. Apparently, she and Milo broke up. No, they didn't. Give her a call. Hey, so I'm going to go to that bookseller's meet and greet in New York tomorrow. You'll be okay on your own for a couple nights? Or do you want to stay with your dad? Mom. I mean, he's got to get used to it, right? Let's just go get some meat. Yeah? Come on. Uh, they've been taking care of their mom. He got tall, but they've been taking care of um the mom. Uh, I'm heading to Conrad's dorm now. All right, meet me there. So she knows where his dorm is? Okay, so Jeremiah is going to Finch and Conrad's going to Brown. Got it, got it. It's a good thing you're here, though, because I don't know what floor he's on or what room he's in. I don't either. I mean, I know he's on the top floor, but that's it. You never visited him at Brown? Yeah, my mom wasn't thrilled about the idea of me driving four and a half hours to go see her boyfriend. This is it. Obviously. C. Fisher. Trotsky. And the door what? is open. Where's his roommate? Hey, Sophie. Um, you wouldn't happen to have any idea where my brother disappeared to? Um, I think he said he was gonna hang out with his cousin by the beach. Cousins! Yo, when you guys broke up, my man fell into a depression. Uh, I, I don't think that was because of me. It definitely was. Like, he was always looking at your picture on his phone. Not Susanna's? Uh, anyway. Okay, um, I'll grab his computer, you grab his books and stuff so you can study, okay? So I can just 
The necklace. Oh boy. She gave him the necklace back. So they broke up. Why would he take off like that to cousins? Because the house is being sold. I mean, I'm sure he's just spending the day surfing and um, he has his phone off. Maybe. No, there's more to it. I mean, if you need me to come. I don't. Cheat the magic. Like Susanna said. Maybe Conrad does. I know that even though he won't say it, Jeremiah wants me to come because he's afraid. I still know this boy better than I know almost anyone. So I'll go for him. I'm, I'm coming with you. Breakfast is my treat. That's very sweet, but save your money for textbook. No, I've got that covered already. My uh, cultural celebration scholarship money came through. You wow, for it he's got a lot of good going on for him. He stayed away from poker, right? He's no longer involved with the poker and stuff after he made that one mistake. Are they gonna run into Taylor? Yeah, I'm not sure she wants to hear from me right now. Nope, because you guys fought. Yeah, no fight. And not a fight. You yelled at her. Do you think I'm a bad mom? No. I can cancel this thing in New York if you guys need Mom, me. stop trying to get out of it. You should go and You're not. Is Cleveland going to be there? Cleveland's going to show up. Okay, and I will keep an eye on her on my end. But Belly's not there. You really are grown up. <laughs> I'm going to try on some boy pants suit, okay? I'm going to hit the BNN. Okay. BNN. Barnes and Noble. Wow, they jumped right back to last year. Them in the car together, driving. Awkwardness. Uh, were you... This is not awkward at all. Hey, how uh, how have you been since? I'm okay. Because you know I'm here. Are you though? You need to talk. Man, it must have been rough when they found out that they were seeing each other again. But I get it, Jeremiah. I do. It's kind of weird being there when it's not summer. I'm sure. Cause none of them are there. Yeah, I bet. On a scale of one to ten, how much trouble do you think we'll be in when they find out we're gone? A hundred. Oh, I'm not kidding. I've never seen a snowy beach. So, they're going to the beach at a different point in the summer. You have no idea how happy she is that you're my girlfriend. So they know. Or at least Susanna knows. Do the moms know? Like, both moms? Like, Laurel knows too? She's getting better, you know. No. Will you try uh, Conrad again? I won't answer. We actually haven't talked since the funeral. What the hell happened with you guys? You never said anything? I need to know. We don't talk about you. Belly's off topic. We don't talk about Belly. Like, we don't talk about Belly. Oh, no. We don't talk about Belly. Oh, it still works out. Oh, shit. There's Taylor. Where's, the, where's my sister? Isn't she supposed to be with you? Uh, yeah. She is. She's describing Auntie Anne's. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, by the way. Oh, what? You and Milo breaking up? Pretty devastated. That terrible fake cry. <laughs> They didn't break up, man. Yeah, I don't know. Like, maybe She's being like, a good friend, great. trying to cover for her best friend. Yeah. Okay, and if you talk to her now, you'll spin her out. Right now, I'm the one who gets to spin out, yeah, because of the breakup. So, ciao. <laughs> I love it. I love Taylor this episode. I love Taylor so far this season. Yeah, he knows now. It's a memoir about me and my best friend. What's it called? called it's not summer without you. <sighs> thank you i'm glad she talked about it because she's gonna have to do a lot of talking about it at the event do is take the jack out and then take the spare off the back that is not for decoration <laughs> jeremiah wait wait well i kind of thought that too for a long time okay mm -hmm. like here mm -hmm. are they gonna just easily go back into like yeah. best friend zone yeah. probably not easy no, but like Need me. I need to move closer to the wheel. I feel like I can't get any more something about it. Fuck! Yeah. Great idea with this belly. It's not my fault. Nothing's ever your fault? Seriously? Now I'm covered in dirt. It's 100 degrees outside, and if you would have just let me call AAA, they'd probably be here already. No, they I'm wouldn't sorry, have. Okay? Thanks. So helpful. No, Jared, not about this. Okay. I do like the fact that they're not rushing like right into the best friend zone, because it's more realistic that way. That, like, they have to fight, and they have to do all that. They have to argue, and they have to talk about it. But, like, do we really have to have the love triangle again? Can they just go back to being best friends, and then she goes back to Conrad? 
We'll have to figure out what happened in the funeral. I kind of knew, because I'm sure, um, I don't know if like they broke up with each other or he broke up with her or she broke up with him. I know we'll figure all that out. But I'm sure like Conrad shut down again, like he did last summer, which is probably why Jeremiah mentioned that he likes to shut down and keep it all to himself. I'm sure that's what happened. Um, again, I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just, like, here for the ride, you know? Okay. I'm sorry because I miss you. Ugh. I missed you for months. She misses her best friend. I called you last night. Yeah, because Conrad was picking up. Jared, you are the one I called, not him. Oh, boy. Look, when Susanna was sick, I was... I was so focused on Conrad and on being there for him. And I should have been there for you too, okay? And I forgot about you and I hate myself for that. I... He was left behind. He was left to himself. That, that happened so fast though. It was really, really bad. I had dad and Conrad sort of, but I needed you and you, you just weren't there. You left me. He lost his best friend. Yeah, no. He lost his mom. I'm not going anywhere. He lost his best friend. That's hard. Cleveland gonna be at this event? I know I keep asking about Cleveland, but like, Laurel needs somebody to help her like move on. And I feel like Cleveland would be that person because he helped Conrad talk through it, everything. I need to talk to my sister, now. She's not there. You're not here right now. Get over it, you baby. Why Terrible you liar. Saying, oh, because, uh, because what? what uh, uh, uh. Fine. She's with Jeremiah. Conrad was MIA, but they figured out that he's a cousin, so they're on their way to go get him right now. Wait, wait, wait. But they're not even talking. Why, why would Jer call her and not me? Because yeah. Belly called but Jeremiah. She knows she screwed up. Because she did. And she's trying to fix it. Oh. She's trying to be what Susanna told oh, her. That she's the magic piece of the house. Mm. She will bring them all back together. Rosie's? Do you want to stop or... Ow. Yes. Now her like friends again? I just mentioned how I like that. I mean, they cried it out. She apologized. He let her know that he missed her and he felt like he was left behind. Glad it's back anyway. R E S P. Yeah, me too. Okay. Oh. <clears throat> I know that you're not eating any pie because you're worried about ruining your abs. <gasps> Yes. I mean, I used to have ESP with a couple of my friends. It kind of got scary. Oh my goodness, it's Nicole. Jara, I was so sorry to hear about your mom. She was so lovely. Yeah, she was. Maybe they all get together. I know that's not possible. What about you? I didn't even know you guys were coming this year. Yeah, we weren't. They're just trying to find Conrad. Well, we should definitely hang. Yes. Bye. You both know I won't call. Yeah. Doesn't feel the same as last summer. No. Oh my god, Olivia Rodrigo again? That Conrad's car? Or like Conrad's car? So they knew they were dating. Jeremiah too? I mean, even if Jeremiah and Belly were never like a thing thing, and they were best friends and just dating the brother, it does sometimes take away from the friend part of it. You know what I mean? Like, that's why a lot of people say, you can't date my brother, you can't date my sister. Cause they feel like it would ruin like the friendship that they have together. But also, they just don't want it to be weird. But I have to say, like the songs are perfect for the show. Again, just like Winter Hill. So is that what the front of the house always looked like? And I just didn't notice. I was so focused on what the back of the house looked like. Ah, oh, see, deja vu. I don't think we came all this way just to sit in my car. Is anyone gonna be there? Oh wow, it is so weird being here in the winter. I know, it's so cold. It's gotta be. Uh, I'm gonna see if we have anything to eat. Maybe we left some Oreos or something. Yeah, good luck. What is she gonna find? <gasps> Hot cocoa. Amazing. I mean, okay. They seem so much older, but they like haven't talked about Jeremiah at all. Which I get it, they're in a relationship, it's fine. We don't talk about siblings all the time. But like, four of them were very close, you would think they still like talk about the memories and where they all are at the time. I don't know about making any sense during this episode with my reaction. I don't. But you know what? It is what it is. So they have a Christmas tree bug in the house okay. when they only are there during the summer? Okay. No, really, why would there be a Christmas tree mug? Because if they're only there for the summer, when do they bring the water? Let's go to the beach! I'll let it go. 
Uh, I love snow. I know a lot of people don't like snow because of like driving in it or everything and all that. And we get a lot of snow sometimes, but it's so pretty at times. Connie, you hear me? Oh boy. I remember this in a trailer. Taylor has enough songs to make up this whole show. Oh, they were so cute together. Did he just shut down and break up with her? Or did something like really happen bad? But I love this side of Conrad. I said that in the first season. When he got like this, this was like my favorite part of Conrad. Why does he still have this pull on me? I don't want to see him and I can't wait for it all at the same time. Because you're in love with him. It's hard to forget that. Obviously it was during winter vacation, right? But like, it's not like five hours away they said or something. So by the time they get there, don't they have to like turn back around and get back home so that Laurel doesn't realize she's not there? Sorry, I, I like really dissecting some of the things sometimes. Oh, it's the shirt that's in her closet. So the last time she was there, this happened. Dude, you have to go back for your bio fund. I'm not leaving. The pictures. Hold on. No, no, that's just... Are you sure? What's more important than that right now, Connie? School doesn't matter. The house matters? Oh, boy. Oh, I hope you know I didn't bring you here just for this. Oh, I know. I want to. I wanted to be with you. I mean, unless, unless you don't want to. No, no. No, I do. I really do. Ugh. <sighs> I love Team Conrad. What's their couple name? I know hers and Jeremiah's Jelly, but I forget what um Taylor. Did Taylor have a couple name for them? Do we have a couple name for them? Let me know in the comments. What is Conrad and Belly's couple name? Conrad? Oh, Conrad? No, no. Sally Kelton. Let me know in the comments. And I'm just gonna like bother me till the end. I mean, I saw this coming. The way he was looking at her when they entered the house. So where did it all go wrong? When Susan left? Susanna left? And I mean, she didn't leave. She died. Jer, the house has been put up for sale. What do you mean the house is for sale? What is she doing here? This is how it ends? Yeah, I saw that coming. Wow. Okay. Oh, I get it. Love scene. It was a love scene. Okay, I get it. It was a love scene. Got it. Okay, I got it. I got it. All right. Okay, I got it. Um, wow. Okay. So that was another part of the trailer. I always love, like, going back and forth with, like, what was seen in the trailer, what wasn't. Um, because a lot of shows or movies, like, now everything's, like, in the trailer. Like, you don't even have to bother watching the movie or, or the show because they basically tell you everything in the trailer. But I, I do like their trailers because it doesn't actually tell you. It actually makes you want to watch them. So... It seems like Belly and Jeremiah are sort of going to be back on track. Um, I want them to stay friends. They're better as friends. We saw all that. We saw that they're better as friends. And Belly will always have Conrad as like number one. I'm sorry. Everyone saw that. Susanna definitely saw it. And Laurel saw it. Steven, I don't know what he saw. I mean, I know he always saw Conrad too. But then when she was with Jeremiah. Uh, but the thing is, it was never. I don't know. It was, it was whatever. Um. So, the main thing here, again, Jeremiah and Belly look like they might be okay. Of course, feelings are going to get involved again. Um, Conrad and Belly were in an actual relationship. He called her his girlfriend. Susanna knew, and I'm guessing Laurel knew too, because they know everything together. There's no secrets among those two. And... Uh, there's definitely a thing between Taylor and Steven. Come on. Steven is so jealous of Milo or whatever. You can see it. 
So Shayla broke up with Steven at the end of summer. I guess from episode one, you know, with the, his speech. It's getting dumped at the end of the summer. Just all of that. So I'm guessing Shayla broke up at the end of the summer. Well, maybe she went, no, in London now for the summer. So I don't know. I don't know. Whatever. Um, yeah, the thing with Nicole was kind of, it's that thing. It's like you run into someone in the store that you haven't seen in a while. And you like casually say, yeah, 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 we got to catch up, got to catch up. And you like are serious about it at that moment. But you also know it's not going to happen. I had that. We actually were serious about it though. But then life got in the way and we just never did. Um, yeah, with my friends that I've known since, um, I guess we'd known each other since elementary school, but we were in school together in middle school. And we were good friends, and we, and then we ran into each other later on, and we were serious about getting together, but it just never happened. Life gets in the way. But there are moments where you do plan things, and as you're saying it, you know it's not going to happen. Um, things change. That was last summer. This summer is completely different. So does that mean she's not going to volleyball camp? Because she's going to have to worry about the house being put up for sale. Which is another big thing. The house is going up for sale. And like Susanna said, Belly is the magic. She believes in the house more than anything. So Belly's going to have to save the day. Of course she's going to need everyone else's help. I mean, how do you sell that house? The house is... Ugh. And then obviously something happened at the funeral. I feel like Conrad shut down again and just took it all out on Belly and just broke up with her. And she obviously gave him the necklace back, which he still has, which he still looks at every day because it's on his table. And I love how I said every day because High School Musical 2, every day, we noticed that Gabriella somehow has her necklace back. Don't know how that happened. Um... Even in the deleted scene, I don't think Taylor gave her the necklace. Cause a lot of people say the deleted scene where Taylor comes gets her for the show. I don't remember her giving her the tea necklace, but whatever. Complete, oh, totally off topic. But the necklace, the infinity necklace, made me think about the tea necklace for Troy. Troy? No, for something else. Of course, for Troy. I'm um, sorry. I love high school musical. But yeah, so the biggest thing right now is the house is up for sale. So they're going to have to figure that out. But Conrad, you still need to go, like, finish your final. And then you could come back. They're there now. Hold the fort so you could go take your final. But wait, that doesn't make sense. College finals are normally in May. College semesters normally end in May, right? And then school normally ends in June. Whether it's early June or late June. I mean, I know everywhere is different. Look, I like dissecting things. I really do. I love dissecting shows and be like, is that really right? The timeline really right? And I let it get to me. I let it get to my head for a while. But, um, yeah, okay. That's enough about that. And then I try and just let it go. But sometimes it's very hard for me. So that's it. That's the first two episodes of season two, and I'm here for it. I feel like so far this season definitely has more OTH vibes, as I've mentioned Winter Hill like a thousand times in this video. Um, but yeah, I do. So we'll see where it goes. I know the love triangle is going to start over again. Because um, uh, she has to. I feel like they're going to push Jeremiah and Belly at Endgame. Because that sort of is what happens. But if we think One Tree Hill like, it will be Conrad and Belly. Because I feel like Jeremiah is the brook of the show. Like, she knew that Lucas always had a thing for Peyton. And then she just like put herself in the situation. Similar to how Jeremiah put himself into the situation. Knowing Belly has like Conrad. This is more like Winter Hill than I thought. Alright, I'm gonna end it on that note. And I was Team Layton. Just like I am Team Conrad and Belly, so. That's what it is. Alright, that's it. I'm done. I'm done rambling. I just went on like a 10 minute ramble. I'm sorry. If you're still here, thank you. If you're not, I understand. But, until next time, 
make sure you hit that subscribe and check out my Patreon because you'll get all the exclusive and the videos are up there like two weeks ahead of time. And yeah, alright. See ya. Bye.